Thank you for joining us. Welcome to the public hearing for the complete property and casualty rate application rulemaking. The purpose for this hearing is to provide the public with an opportunity to comment on Commissioner Lara's proposed regulations. Any oral comments or written comments submitted will become part of the public record for these proceedings. We will now hear from those who wish to provide oral comments. Okay, the first speaker in the queue, in the queue is Carl Sussman. Well, thank you for providing me the time to speak today. My name is Carl Sussman. I'm an insurance broker, insurance expert witness, and a host of a radio talk show syndicated across California about insurance. Suffice it to say, I talk with a lot of consumers about insurance. Everyone here already knows, or certainly should know, that the insurance industry in California is in a major crisis. Insurers are non-renewing policies and not offering policies. Others are leaving the state, while others are actually leaving the industry entirely because they can't afford to be in it anymore. Proposition 103 made the California Insurance Commissioner an elected position. So the residents of California have spoken, voted, and they have elected Commissioner Lara, not once, but twice. He has responded to the California insurance marketplace situation by creating the sustainable insurance strategy. I applaud the commissioner for stepping up and stepping in and being proactive in addressing the lack of insurance competition and availability. And I invite everyone, including those purporting to represent consumers, to step aside, let him do his job that he was elected to do. Remember, he was elected by the consumers twice. Let's let him do his thing. So the first part of these new regulations that we're here today discussing address a specific issue, and that being how admitted insurance companies request changes to underwriting and premiums they charge. The exciting part is both the insurance commissioner and the insurance industry in general agree wholeheartedly on what this first regulation fixes, namely the fact that any changes submitted by an insurer currently can take months or even years of back and forth before it can be put into place. Add that to the time it takes for the insurer to actually roll out the change and then actually see results from it we're looking at years from start to finish. This lengthy process prevents all admitted insurance companies from being nimble, innovative, and it's costing the California Department of Insurance a ton of resources with having to deal with the back and forth on a continual basis. This waste of resources on both sides can be eliminated by this first set of regulations we're talking about today. Anyone who's telling you that a complete application from the get-go would actually slow things down is just not living in reality. Time is money, and this up and back is wasting money on the part of the Department of Insurance and the admitted insurance companies that want to compete in California. Mind you that according to Proposition 103 and Insurance Code Section 1861.01, rates must not be inadequate, excessive, or unfairly discriminatory. All this new regulation is doing is providing the Department of Insurance with the information they want, the information they've wanted from day one to enable them to make the appropriate decision. Finally, be aware again that Proposition 103 encourages public participation in rate making. This new regulation does not in any way, shape, or form change that. Prop 103 is not designed, at least I hope, not for, the, for one single entity to act as a pseudo-secondary Department of Insurance overseer or an all-knowing insurance czar that has de facto veto power to prevent the Department of Insurance from actually doing their job. Thank you. Thank you. 